Hello, everybody. This is a pick a card reading for today, Tuesday, April 12th. You pick a card. It is going to be your main energy, but I do pull the cards for everyone. In April 12th, birthday, I will do your reading next. So if you pick card number one, King of Pentacles. It is a person card, so it could be dealing with a earth sign, usually male. Um, so that is the energy, and it is money-focused, work-focused, and also things of value, okay? There is some growth. For someone out there, you've been working very hard, um, and you pretty much are going to reap the benefits, but there is an energy here to kind of get some rest and kind of rejuvenate again, okay? So I do feel also there is a Scorpio energy here for some reason I'm picking up. Um, dealing with the Scorpio too. Um, this is finances, uh, balance, but he knows what he wants. He's got the Midas touch. So this is definitely showing up. Um, a wish fulfillment may come through and there is an energy that some of you could be dwelling into a lot of like prayers, wishes, um, very uh, ho uh, hoping for something, but it's been heard. So it's on its way. Card number two is the queen of pentacles. Wow. We got the king and queen today. It's going to be interesting with the collective two people cards. All right. So with the queen of pentacles here, know that you are positively moving forward. Okay. Um, some of you, I've got your finances under control, um, but then there's a lot of like responsibilities you're taking care of, of a lot. There is going to be a quick sudden change. Okay. And it is moving forward. You need to trust that you are in um, heading in the right direction, okay? Um, this can also be someone else helping you out somehow. There could be something that you are teaching others or teaching, um, I want to say taking care of children, people younger. There's a need to kind of be service to um, or you're wanting to. But there is a quick sudden change here, too. So this is a focus on money and also doing well. Hmm, interesting. Okay. The, wow, a lot of people cards today. This is a busy day. Um, I'll get to the collective in a minute. Queen of Cups for card number three. Wow, you could be dealing with a female again, a water sign female usually, but it doesn't necessarily mean so. But this energy that I'm feeling is your intuition, you know, something is, um, there is more clarity. There is a material and spiritual prosperity on its way, okay? So I do feel that this could be a spark of a new idea or a new way of doing things and a new ideas coming through, all right? Kind of watch the emotions as well, too, but your intuition's sharp. Now, picking, uh, pulling this all together is a quite interesting day. We have the King of Pentacles, we have the Queen of Pentacles, and we have the Queen of Cups. So, um, pay attention to people around you. We could be surrounded by a lot of people. So there's a lot of energy with people around. Okay. There is a sense of things are moving quickly. Um, there's an accelerated motion. Um, so this is a time to know that we could get really, really busy. Uh, there's fortune and luck on all sides. There's a totally shift of energy, total shift of energy. Kind of expect the unexpected. Something is turning around here. Okay. So I do feel that energy, uh, very hopeful energy. Okay. This could be also a couple and this is going into either partnerships or um, money making ideas, but it's something that's very valuable um, long term as well. So I am liking that energy. Um, I do feel that um, also this is you're going in the right direction. Whatever that you're doing is mostly in the right direction. For some of you, maybe taking on some study or courses is what I'm feeling as well. You could be also, there could be an intervention today. Um, maybe you're part of it or there's a group meeting or some kind of intervention is what I'm feeling as well. Okay. Um, I do feel also there is sparks of a new idea or creating this new journey, new path. Okay. Um, I also see that we're more balanced, uh, ready to make a decision with confidence today, though we have some challenges and these could be more internal challenges. Okay. Anticipating challenges. All right. So I do feel that there is a lot of movement, choices and decisions um, today. Oops, almost dropped this. But there is a down, a little bit of a downside here. 
we may not feel like being very emotional and we might tend to kind of ignore any emotional needs that we might have today too. Our sense of values may also be kind of conflicting with our feelings. Values versus feelings is what I'm feeling here too. Um, it's a time to make um, some strong choices, but it, 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 we could be making some um, wrong choices. So we have to think things through, particularly if they affect our living situation. Um, we may feel a little cut off from people's uh, friends, family, or something like that, or unable to make good decisions, almost as indecisions too. There's an urge here for, you know, there's been a lot of work in that for a social life that can quickly turn into good times to hard times as well, or something like that is showing up. Um, you could expect a little boost here, some sort of extra help or recognition from those around you. Um, you may feel that you're in touch with some, but um, you need to be also in harmony with others, kind of open the lines of communications. The support you need is there, okay? But you may feel that you find yourself being put to use somehow, okay? And this is by people around you, friends, or whatever it is, um, or it could be the circumstances that kind of force you to reorganize your thoughts and feelings and be more conservative. I mean, all of this should go rather smoothly, but, um, I mean, there's a tactical approach here, too, uh, with qualities that you have. But um, And they will be found to be made valuable, but the only thing is that up and down energy. Um, I do feel also there is a strong energy here of confidence and intuition combined is very important as well. Okay? Now... Um, I do feel also here things will fall into place. Could be dealing with the Libra energy too is what I'm feeling. There should be some good news. Some news arriving and it's good. There's a lot of help around us today too. So if we need it, it's there in support. I do pick up a Cancer energy as well. All right. But um, I do feel that maybe you're going to have to adjust something the next couple weeks. I don't know why I'm picking up two weeks, two weeks, two weeks or something like that. These are sacrifices that you make too, um, or you have to kind of like make time for responsibilities and get things in order. I mean, there's a sense of making some sacrificial energies here, sacrificing um, something to um, get something under control. So I do feel that energy. There is movement, choices, and decisions today. Okay. I know. Interesting reading, huh? All right. So that is the reading for today, Tuesday, April 12th. I hope you have a fabulous day. Happy birthday if you are born today, April 12th. This is your solar, your theme, and this is your wish card. All right, so your theme is a major arcana of the full. Fate and destiny is one thing. New beginnings is another. Taking a leap of faith, and I do feel some of you are taking more authority in your life this um, solar year. For some of you, be careful with people in authority, okay? But there's a new beginning. There is a new beginning, they could be some someone or something that has been a, bur a burden or they you just had some conflicts with them. They may be leaving is what I'm feeling. There is more of a, um, okay, let's uh, sit down, put all the cards on the table type of energy. For some of you, this is generous energy and people help, helping you in authority as well is what I'm feeling, okay? Um, I do feel here your passions are ignited. There's more passionate energy and you're ready to move forward as well. It's an adventurous energy. There are delays that you're going to occur that are going to occur. Pay attention to your dreams. They may signify something. Your intuition is strong as well. For some of you, females are going to be very strong um, accident during your, during your solar year. Um, I do feel there's going to be some fulfillment of wishes but it will also come with some kind of delays and divine timing, all right? But there will be, um, there will be some, uh, some significant fulfillment of wishes. This is a year where you're going to get more serious about things. You're a survivor, and you will shut down communications with some people who no longer serve you. So I do feel that. It's like being true to yourself and taking your power back. I do feel that energy, okay? Especially with a female. I feel this female is... Um, 
um, this person has been very critical. This person has talked behind your back. This person has been trying to kind of, it was, e she's evil eyeing too. So this is taking your power back and maybe cutting down uh, communications with this person. Um, there is a significant wish fulfillment that's going to kind of open up things for you, happiness, but do things in moderation. I see victory and success for you. And also be careful of, um, you know, cutting out some things. You may be like throwing the baby out with the bathwater because not, you know, um, there could be some debates. You're not on the same page with some people. So um, be careful of that. You need a balance. Okay. So you may need someone. So be careful who you cut out because I see people's situations leaving your life. You may have a victory, but then you kind of have a loss. Understand it's a no win situation. But making some um, changes is uh, showing up and creating a balance with even your thoughts and readjusting some perspectives that you had. It's like a reboot of the brain. <laughs> All right. So we are seeing that energy uh, coming through as well. So a balance is needed too. All right. And your wish for your soul year is the Queen of Cups. Okay. So I do feel um, follow your intuition. It's going to guide you. But then there's a sense of you need to be clear what you do want because this is, um, I feel there's some mental conflict about this or emotional conflict with it. All right. So there is, um, there is a beginning with this wish, but, um, it's a, it's in the beginning stages. Let's put it that way. Okay. Uh, for some of you, this is a, yes, it's like, it will come through, uh, just a little bit of, co um, conflict here. All right. Um, the important numbers for your solar year, five, six, nine, 28, 27, one, four, two, 100, nine, and 11. I hope you have a wonderful birthday and a blessed solar year ahead and beyond. Everyone else, a wonderful Tuesday, and bye for now.